Hi everyone. I wanted to take this time to wish everyone a happy Lunar New Year. A few of our developers are here to talk about some of the great things that happened in 2015 and what we have to look forward to in the new year. Greetings from Blizzard Entertainment. My name is Ben Brode, lead designer for Hearthstone, and it's been a busy year at the Inn. We went fully mobile with the launch of Hearthstone for iPhone and Android phones, proving that you can pull up a chair virtually anywhere. We also ventured into Blackrock Mountain, joined the League of Explorers, and tried our hand at jousting with the Grand Tournament. And if that weren't enough, we introduced a brand new game mode called Tavern Brawl. Hearthstone also has had a really exciting year in the realm of esports, with competitions ranging from tournaments in local communities to qualifiers for the World Championship Series. Regardless of the level of play, enthusiasm, and passion for the game, was in no short supply, and we can't wait to see what 2016 holds as we continue this momentum. Hi, I'm David Kim, lead multiplayer designer of StarCraft II. 2015 was a huge year for StarCraft players. The much-anticipated final chapter to the StarCraft II trilogy, Legacy of the Void, was released in November of this year, bringing 17 years of epic storytelling full circle. Not only that, but the expansion came with all kinds of new content for players to enjoy, including Archon mode and co-op missions. While the story has come to its end, we expect to see a lot of new content in 2016, including new maps, co-op missions, and the brand new Nova Covert Ops missions. We hope to see you in the Corprulu sector in the new year. Hi everybody, this is Jeff Kaplan from the Overwatch team. It's been an amazing time since we announced the game at BlizzCon in 2014. Since that time, we've introduced the world to nine brand new heroes, bringing our total up to 21. We also introduced five new maps over the course of the year, bringing the total up to eight maps. We took the game to all sorts of fascinating locations throughout the world. We were at Gamescom in Cologne, Germany. We were at China Joy, which was fantastic and we had the game playable in Prague for the road to BlizzCon. But as great as this year was, we're even more excited for next year when all of you get to play the game. Prepare for battle and we'll see you in the spring of 2016. Hi, I'm Phil Gonzalez. I'm a lead character artist on Heroes of the Storm. Heroes of the Storm initiated its launch sequence earlier this year and has been going strong ever since. We added tons of new heroes, maps, skins, and unveiled an all-new play mode, the Arena, this past BlizzCon. We even introduced the world to our first ever two-player character, Chogol. We also took over ESPN for the evening to broadcast our inaugural Heroes of the Dorm tournament. You see Berkeley has done it! And crowned Cloud9 as our very first Heroes of the Storm world champion. It was a momentous year, and 2016 is shaping up to be even more action-packed. We'll see you in the Nexus. Greetings, Nephilim. I'm Wyatt Chang, live patch lead of Diablo 3. This year was filled with some hefty new content. Patch 2.3 saw a slew of exciting new features, including the Ruins of Sesheron and Kanai's Cube, a powerful artifact that takes customization to a whole new level. The team is hard at work polishing up Patch 2.4, and we're excited to kick off Season 5 with new features, such as the Grey Hollow Island, the Royal Quarters, and Set Dungeons. With new enemies to slay and epic loot awaiting you in 2016, we hope you're just as hyped about the new patch as we are. We'll see you in Sanctuary. Greetings, Champions of Azeroth. My name is Ian Hasekostas, and I'm the Assistant Game Director on World of Warcraft. So 2015 has been an incredible year for us. We began by going to the Blackrock Foundry, taking the fight to the Iron Horde there, and then venturing into the depths of Tanan Jungle, where we fought all the way to Hellfire Citadel, to the top of the Citadel, where we defeated the Iron Horde once and for all, but set in motion a new and greater threat. And we saw how that unfolded when we announced our Legion expansion, the next chapter in World of Warcraft featuring the Demon Hunter class, artifacts, and much more. We just recently began our alpha test for Legion. And we can't wait. We're so excited to share it with everybody. I'd like to wish everyone a very happy new year. Thank you again for all the support you have shown over the past year. From everyone here at Blizzard Entertainment, have a happy, healthy, and prosperous new year. <laughs>